Tyronean notes Latin, note Tyronianae, or Tyronian shorthand is a system of shorthand invented by Tiro BC, Marcus Tullius Cicero's slave and personal secretary, and later his freedman. Tiro's system consisted of about 4,000 symbols that were extended in classical times to 5,000 signs. During the medieval period, Tiro's notation system was taught in European monasteries and was extended to about 13,000 signs. Tyronean notes declined after 1100 but were still in some use in the 17th century, and a very few are still used today. <laughs> Note on sign counts Tyronean notes can be themselves composites ligatures of simpler Tyronean notes, the resulting compound still being far shorter than the word it replaces. This accounts in part for the large number of attested Tyronean notes, and for the wide variation in estimates of the total number of Tyronean notes. Further, the same sign can have other variant forms, leading to the same issue. History Topic. Topic. Development Topic. Nicknamed the father of stenography by historians, Tiro 94 BC to 4 AD was a slave and later a freedman who served as Marcus Tullius Cicero S. 106 BC personal secretary. Like others in his position, Tiro was required to quickly and accurately transcribe dictations from Cicero, such as speeches, professional and personal correspondence, and business transactions, sometimes while walking through the forum or during fast paced and contentious government and legal proceedings. The only systematized form of abbreviation in Latin at the time was used for legal notations, note juris, but it was deliberately abstruse and only accessible to people with specialized knowledge. Otherwise shorthand was improvised for note-taking or writing personal communications and these notations would not have been understood outside of closed circles. Some abbreviations of Latin words and phrases were commonly recognized, such as those inscribed on monuments, but according to literature professor Anthony D. Renzo, up to this point, no true Latin shorthand existed. Scholars believe that after learning about the intricacies of the Greek shorthand system, Cicero recognized the need for a comprehensive, standard Latin notation system and delegated the task of creating one to his slave, Tiro, whose highly refined and accurate method became became the first standardized and widely adopted system of Latin shorthand. Tyronean notes also known as Tyronean shorthand, consisted of abbreviations with Latin letters, abstract symbols contrived by Tiro, and symbols borrowed from Greek shorthand. Tiro S notes represented prepositions, truncated words, contractions, syllables, and inflections. According to Di Renzo, Tiro then combined these mixed signs like notes in a score to record not just phrases, but, as Cicero marvels in a letter to Atticus, whole sentences. Controversy Dio Cassius attributes the invention of shorthand to Macenus, and states that he employed his freedman Aquila in teaching the system to numerous others. Isidore of Seville, however, details another version of the early history of the system, ascribing the invention of the art to Quintus Ennius, who he says invented 1100 marks Latin, note. Isidore states that Tiro brought the practice to Rome, but only used Tyronean notes for prepositions. According to Plutarch in Life of Cato the Younger, 1683, Cicero's secretaries established the first examples of the art of Latin shorthand. This only of all Cato's speeches, it is said, was preserved, for Cicero, the consul, had disposed in various parts of the Senate House, several of the most expert and rapid writers, whom he had taught to make figures comprising numerous words in a few short strokes, as up to that time they had not used those we call shorthand writers, who then, as it is said, established the first example of the art. Topic. Introduction Topic. There are no surviving copies of Tiro. 
s original manual and code, so our knowledge of it is based on biographical records and copies of Tyronean tables from the medieval period. Historians typically date the invention of Tiro. S system as 63 BC, when it was first used in official government business according to Plutarch in his biography of Cato the Younger in the Lives of the Noble Grecians and Romans 1683. Before Tiro's system was institutionalized, he used it himself as he was developing and fine-tuning it, which historians suspect may have been as early as early as 75 BC when Cicero held public office in Sicily and needed his notes and correspondences to be written in code to protect sensitive information he had gathered about corruption among other government officials there. There is evidence that Tiro taught his system to Cicero and his other scribes, and possibly to his friends and family, before it was widely used. In Life of Cato the Younger, Plutarch wrote that during Senate hearings in 65 BC relating to the first Catalinarian conspiracy, Tiro and Cicero's other secretaries were in the audience meticulously and rapidly transcribing Cicero's oration. On many of the oldest Tyronean tables, lines from this speech were frequently used as examples, leading scholars to theorize it was originally transcribed using Tyronean shorthand. Scholars also believe that in preparation for speeches, Tiro drafted outlines in shorthand that Cicero used as notes while speaking. Topic. Expansion Topic. Isidore tells of the development of additional Tyronean notes by various hands, viz. Vipsanius, Philurgius, and Aquila as above, until Seneca systematized the various marks to approximately 5,000 Tyronean notes. Use in the Middle Ages Entering the Middle Ages, Tiro's shorthand was often used in combination with other abbreviations and the original symbols were expanded to 14,000 symbols during the Carolingian dynasty, but it quickly fell out of favor as shorthand became associated with witchcraft and magic and was forgotten until interest was rekindled by Thomas Becket, Archbishop of Canterbury, in the 12th century. In the 15th century Johannes Trithemius, abbot of the Benedictine Abbey of Sponheim, discovered the Note Benenses, a psalm and a Ciceronian lexicon written in Tyronean shorthand. Topic current topic Tyronean notes are still used today, particularly the Tyronean et, used in Ireland and Scotland to mean and where it is called Agus in Irish and Agus in Scottish Gaelic, and in the z of viz, for et in Videlicet. In blackletter texts especially in German printing it was used in the abbreviation C, equals etc. for etc. still throughout the 19th century. The Tyronean et can look very similar to an R rotunda, depending on the typeface. In Old English manuscripts, the Tyronean et served as both a phonetic and morphological placeholder. For instance a Tyronean et between two words would be phonetically pronounced and would mean and. However, if the Tyronean et followed the letter s, then it would be phonetically pronounced son and mean water ancestral to modern English sound. This additional function of a phonetic as well as a conjunction placeholder has escaped formal modern English. For example, one may not spell the word sand as s and although this occurs in an informal style practiced on certain internet forums. This practice was distinct from the occasional use of and c for etc., where the an is interpreted as the Latin word et and, and the c is an abbreviation for Latin cetera the rest. Topic support on computers topic It is not easy to use Tyronean notes on modern computing devices. The Tyronean et and is available at Unicode point U plus 204A, and can be made to display e.g. for documents written in Irish or Scottish Gaelic on a relatively wide range of devices. On Microsoft Windows, it can be shown in Sego UI symbol a font that comes bundled with Windows Vista onwards, on macOS and iOS devices in Helvetica, and on Windows, macOS, Google Chrome OS, and Linux in the free Deja Vu Sans font which comes bundled with Chrome OS and various Linux distributions. Some applications and websites, such as the online edition of the Dictionary of the Irish Language, substitute the Tyronean et with the box drawing character U plus 2510, as it looks similar and displays widely. The numeral 7 is also used in informal contexts such as internet forums and occasionally in print. A number of other Tyronean signs have been assigned to the private use area of Unicode by the Medieval Unicode Font Initiative, MUFI, who also provide links to free typefaces that support their specifications. 
Topic Gallery. Topic. Topic. See also. Topic. Ampersand. Gaelic script. Scribal abbreviation. Topic. References. Topic. Topic. External links. Topic. Wilhelm Schmitz, Commentary Notarum Tyronianarum, 1893 Latin. Emile Chatelain, Introduction à la lecture des notes Tyroniennes, 1900 French. Karl Eberhard Henk, Uber Tyronische Noten Manuscript B16 of the Bibliothèque der Monumenta Germania Historica. C. 1960 German C33, within for examples of composite Tyronian notes. Martin Hellman, Supertextus Notarum Tyronianarum Online Dictionary of Tyronian Notes, based on Schmidt's 1893 German.